Do you know that you are a unique gift to the world? I hope so. I'm Brenda Florida, life coach and lifestyle advisor, and this is a special day for me. It's December 4th, and we're here with our Live Lavishly Light episode number four, and the light that I want to spread to you today and for you to think about this week is just the unique gift that you are to the world. You know, we're headed into the holiday season and everyone's thinking about gifts and gift giving. Well, I just want to remind you today and for you to take with you this week the reality that you are the gift. So today uh, is a little special for me because it is my youngest son's birthday, Scott, Florida. He's 30 today, which I can't hardly imagine. It feels like yesterday I was 30. Uh, but so uh, Scott, I hope you're having a wonderful birthday. He lives in Africa, so he's very far away and hoping that 2018 will bring him home to us. But um, he knows that it's always been my desire that, you know, he live his best life. Right? What kind of a life coach would I be if I wanted my kids to stay home so they'd be close to me if they wanted to go off and have an adventure? So um, I'm super thrilled that he did that. Uh, but it made me think of uh, a really great book that actually I found a couple years ago. It's called, if you can see that, On the Night That You Were Born. And I won't read the whole book to you. Uh, but in, in light of our Live Lavishly Light today, I just thought it was perfect. And it starts out by saying, on the night you were born, the moon smiled with such wonder that the stars peeked in to see you, and the night wind whispered, life will never be the same, because there had never been anyone like you ever in the world. And I love that. I love that truth, that there's no one in the world like you. There's no one in the world like me. There's no one in the world like my son, Scott. And there's no one in the world like any of his siblings. He's one of four. And, um, you know, we're all a unique gift to the world. And that's why I feel like we have such a, I mean, almost an obligation, but I don't want to use that word in a way that feels negative, um, but an obligation to express our gifts. Because if we don't do it, no one will do it. We, we have those unique gifts and just our way of doing things, be they big or small, that the world needs. So I hope as you go into this week, and I know we're really winding up into the hustle bustle of the holidays, but I hope that you'll just take a little bit of time to appreciate the light that you are to the world, the gift that you are to the world. And when we see ourselves that way, it's easier to see others that way as well. So happy birthday, Scott. And thank you to all of my viewers today. I hope you have a wonderful week filled with lots of light.